All right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to take our head down to the local McDonald's, right? We're going to acquire ourselves a cheeseburger. We're going to upgrade that cheeseburger to a Big Mac and see if we can save ourselves some money because I'm very hungry, as y'all saw. So let's go. Can I have a cheeseburger, please? I'm sorry. I want a cheeseburger, okay? Is it a cheeseburger with what? Add the sesame bun. Which bun? I want to also add the patty. Just one patty on the cheeseburger. I'm sorry, add what? A patty. Okay. And then add lettuce. I'm sorry, I'm having a hard time hearing you. Okay, hey, thank you. Damn, my little dry man. Anybody got chest in there? Hmm. All right. We secured the bag. Let's see what they gave us. Pretty much all we did was we made a Big Mac, but we made it a cheeseburger. So we're gonna see whether they made our cheeseburger a Big Mac so we can cut costs and at the same time fill this belly up because we hungry. Let's see what we got. So here's the Big Mac, right? Now we ordered a cheeseburger that's supposed to be like a Big Mac. No middle bun. No middle bun, man. They fucked up the middle bun, right? You know what? I'm about to go get my middle bun, man. I feel some type of way. I feel some type of way. Boys, yeah, boys. I just acquired me another middle bun for the cheeseburger just now. So now we have ourselves a middle bun. Now, the only difference between the two the Big Mac has slightly more sauce and slightly more, um, pretty much condiments than the cheeseburger does. Because it has some on the top, right? It has some on the top, and it has more on the bottom of the bun as well. But it's essentially the same sandwich. Um, let me check the receipt to see what the price difference between the two is. Alright, so the math was just done, man. The cheeseburger was $1. All the condiments was $0.45. Cents. The extra beef patty was 80 cents. So that gives us to a total of 225 for the cheeseburger that was made into a Big Mac. The Big Mac itself is 429. So almost, let's do that. 429 minus 225. That's a $2 difference. A whole $2 difference. Just just because of the name like this i don't know like i don't know why there's a big difference but there's a whole two dollar difference i just saved myself two dollars this is a life hack if you're trying to hack like i get like me get on my game man you see how we hustle out here man they real hustle like, people talking about hustle this is real hustle so do what I did, man. Just add all the stuff onto the regular cheeseburger. The cheeseburger is pretty much one of the cheapest. Well, actually, it is the cheapest burger you can get on the menu. Get yourself a cheeseburger. Add all the things you want to add on to it. It's going to be a little extra charge, but it's not going to be up, up to the $4.29 that we paid for on the Big Mac. So that's how we're running it. But we're going to go ahead and try these burgers out and see which one is talking to us more. You know what I mean? Actually, let's do the taste test to see if they actually taste the same. So here's the, um, here's, this is the regular cheeseburger. So we're going to try out the cheeseburger, man. We're going to try the cheeseburger first.
Swear to God, it tastes like a Big Mac without without that much sauce, without that much condiments. It's a little dry. That's the only thing. Make sure y'all add some more extra condiments if you want to. If y'all doing the same thing I'm going to do. Now we're going to try out the Big Mac to see what the difference is. This one's got plenty more condiments. It's just falling out as I'm holding the sandwich. So let's try this one. Hold on. Like this one is just nasty. I'm telling y'all, the sandwiches taste the same. I just found myself a white pack. But that's all for now, guys. Y'all check me out in the next video, man. Stay tuned. Make sure y'all subscribe. You know, stay tuned for more things like this. More hacks. More creative content. More good things to come, man. Y'all stay up.